Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And uh, what does Patch Tuesday of July 2025 look like? Well, it's a pretty good one. It's a pretty big one, especially if you're a user of Microsoft Office. So um, in July 2025, the fixes uh, are for 137 security flaws. One of them is a zero day, exploded in the wild. And there's a lot of critical vulnerabilities across the different uh, services and platforms. So that includes 53 elevation of privilege vulnerability, eight security feature bypass vulnerabilities. Uh, that also includes 41 remote code execution vulnerabilities. There's 18 information disclosure vulnerabilities. There's six denial of service vulnerabilities and force spoofing flaws in there. So um, that does not include uh, some that were in Microsoft Edge and the security flaws. So for servers, there's the Microsoft SQL Server um, information disclosure that is a critical flaw and is the zero day that we mentioned. Uh, for the rest, there's tons of updates for other uh, things, even uh, including updates for the AMD um, architecture CPU. So there's some critical flaws there that are fixed from different uh, companies. A lot of critical flaws in Microsoft Office itself with remote code execution vulnerabilities and SharePoint, Microsoft Office Word. So there's a lot of stuff in there. And the Windows side, uh, there's the Hyper-V uh, that has a critical flaw. There's also critical flaws in the Windows Imaging Component for information disclosure. Windows KDC Proxy Service, uh, remote code execution there is critical. So uh, there's uh, also uh, Windows... Uh, extended negotiation security mechanism that has a remote code execution critical. And for the rest, most of them are important. So lots of uh, very important stuff to fix this month in your Windows updates. So both Windows 10, Windows 11. And of course, if you're using Microsoft Office, make sure that it is part of the cycle of updating Office. In Windows, you have a check mark where it says you can update other components at the same time that includes Microsoft Office. So do check that out because there's quite a few flaws in Office this month. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.